Hoven says, we haven't talked about the Joker movie yet, so we're going to go into that quickly. He says, is the actor of the Joker movie the Suicide Squad 1? So there are two spin-off Joker movies. One, which, Wait, is it announced? Was legit too? Yeah. I thought they scrapped the one. Oh, that's still happening. What? Why? Yeah, so I guess, so there's one not connected to the DCU, and there's this one, which is Jared Leto, so the guy from Suicide Squad, <laughs> even though he already has three other movies he's coming out in, because I heard he's coming out in the Suicide Squad 2, Harley Quinn Solo, no, three, I guess, and, uh, the Birds of Prey. Mm. So, oh, wow. Like, can we just make him a good Joker first before we put him all these movies? So that, that's that's a lot of, uh, what is it, chickens before the eggs happen. Also, can yeah. we also have Man of Steel 2 before we have these pointless movies? Yeah, I'd like to see a second uh, Superman one for so, sure. Well, yeah. Man of Steel is like the Iron Man of this universe, and they're like telling him to basically Kick shave rocks. and yeah. Yeah, just chill. <laughs> yeah, I, I th- I, I was they're shaving really, him for later. I didn't care for the Leto Joker. No. Um, I was really actually looking forward to the Joaquin Phoenix one, though. Uh, I rewatched mm-hmm. Gladiator, <laughs> and I was like, you know what? Especially when he had his tongue out at that scene, and he plays that. Really nah, movie. yeah, yeah. I'm like, he. When they're redoing be... the Battle of Carthage. Oh, such yeah, a great battle. Scene. Yeah. Such a great movie. It was. Yeah, so yeah. Good. Agreed. There's some good lines out of that. that that's kind of stuff, though. I don't know if Joker standalone um, one is enough. I hope they just scrap the DCU now and restart. We've talked about this before, though. I think they just need to make good movies. Yeah. But just pace themselves with the movies make relevant movies though like, yeah i mean and we, we had the we had the argument before and yeah i mean joker it's been years since heath ledger no one's gonna forget it yeah but nobody's gonna top it no one's gonna I, and no maybe no one ever will top it who knows but why would you put out two you haven't even picked that's just confusing though you haven't even picked the batman yet mm-hmm. that's a good point you haven't picked the batman and in my opinion I think the beauty of the Joker, same with the beauty of Batman, is the fact that Batman goes up against Joker. It's it's that unstoppable force, unmovable object. Yeah. Also, adding on, so the thing I really like about DCU was that Zack Snyder was the guy making the movies, right? And if you love him or hate him, the movies at least were consistent. Where Superman of Steel was kind of dark, BBS was really dark, but then you had like Wonder Woman, which was a different director, so obviously it's be a different tone, which is fine. But then you had Justice League, which was a mix of both, because they kind of like told Zack Snyder that his, like he had a vision, like he had all these Easter eggs planned and like he was going to, I saw a comparison of this deleted scene of Superman walking into some cave, like it was, I think it was his solitude place. Yeah, Fortress, Fortress Solitude. Like from Man of Steel, the same shot where he walks in, but you know, you never see it because they cut it out of the movie. So I wish I just got to see Justice League in his way, just so it could kind of end the trilogy of that he kind of set up. I like Zack Snyder. <laughs> also, he did confirm. So I you know I said deep. Wait, you know I said he uh, that scene from Man of Steel, the fight was like DBZ inspired, like it looked like it was. Yeah. It was. It was awesome. It was. I, really I, I want Man him to do a DBZ movie. I really like Man of Steel. Dragon Ball. I, no, don't have him do one. Have him shoot one. Yes. Do the cinematography for and maybe choreograph it. Because I've said. This I think before. Christopher Nolan would be able to do a good one. No, I don't think so. With, I, he, he can't work with Well, no, I guess he'd, he'd make it realistic. Yeah, he, he wouldn't be able to work with something so bombastic. Steven Spielberg? No. I don't know any good directors to do this. Yeah. Uh, he also says, the first Man of Steel was really cool. I hope they make the second one good too. Yeah, agreed. If they do make one, I hope it's good as well. 